already on? I don't know how to work this. Just keep on, keep on. Could you imagine like someone's already in here? <laughs> Just watching TV. The TV's already on. Oh, this is nice. Oh, look at this bed. Look at okay. Do we not close the door? Let's look at this balcony. So it actually turns out that we gotta keep the cards. Oh, sorry. Shit, drop the card. You gotta put the card in the thing to activate the lights. I like I like this idea of like an open concept, like how. Like, Alright, so let me kind of explain what was going on. I couldn't really talk while I was recording, mostly because the boat was really loud. So yeah, there was another couple on the charter boat with us, which you'll see in the next few clips. I'm gonna kind of say my opinion on whether or not these deep sea excursions are even worth what you're paying for in Mexico. But yeah, I'll, I'll talk about that more at the end of the video. So yeah, the way this kind of fishing thing works is, like I said, there was another couple on the boat with us, and we all kind of just took turns. We actually hooked into a fish right away. We were trolling for about five minutes, and as you saw, not to brag or anything, but I did hook into two fish at the same time. The tour guide said they were tunas, and this is my first time fishing, so or deep sea fishing, so I, I don't really, I don't really know fish in the ocean too well. But yeah, I'm just gonna take his word on it. These next two clips are of the couple that were on the boat with us.
So yeah, we were uh, trolling for about three hours and we only ended up catching four different fish including the two that you or that I caught. So when it was my turn in rotation again, um, you, you know what, just watch, just, just watch the clip. <laughs> But don't get me wrong, I am not complaining. I could have easily not caught any fish at all this whole entire trip. So yeah, after this the guide took us to a shallow area so we could do some bottom fishing. So that pretty much sums up the video. We uh, we ended up catching a few more white snappers. I think that's what the tour guides called them. But yeah, that was overall a really, really cool experience. Sucks that I wasn't able to pull in a barracuda, but it's all good though. I get to add two new species to my list. I'd give this trip a solid seven out of 10. Considering that this trip was only, I think we paid 160 per person. I don't know if that's cheap compared to other charter boats. I don't know, man. I just, I didn't think it was that expensive for a four hour trip. But yeah, so if you made it this far into the video, thank you very much. I, I really do hope you enjoyed the video. You know, you could uh, you could hit that like button. It'll really help me out. Or if you really want to make my day, you can go down there and hit that little red subscribe button. And yeah, other than that, I will see you guys in the next one. Daddy, 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 daddy